Hi Gemini, welcome back to Omkara Tarot and to your love bite. Yes, I did say I was going to change my schedule, but we are, our love bites are back as uh, always because of the unanimous vote I think all of you sent to say Omkara Tarot, please don't change a thing. So well, we are back to the whole schedule um, Gemini and I will post other, other kinds of readings for you as well as and when I get time in the middle. So I can't promise you a particular time and a you know day or anything like that so make sure your notification bells are on so you don't miss those okay so gems let's start your reading let's see what message wants to show through for you today and a warm welcome back to all my subscribers thank you thank you for being here again and Gemini if you're new here we welcome you as well do join us subscribe to the channel become part of us we welcome you in so gems oh huge fight here gemini what happened here argument fight uh, bitterness oh, somebody made a decision here mm, okay somebody still wants this though the six of pentacles somebody still wants an equal give and take i think uh, I think there's been a fight because maybe one person said I don't want to commit or something there's been an argument there's you know the queen of swords in reverse is a very angry and bitter person maybe sometimes mm, overly so uh, this person doesn't trust maybe they were just angry because of this decision of non-committal from their partner there's been an argument about why why not i don't know but from what i feel um, i don't know gems i'm going to clarify these cards because it does end up nice okay let's see let's um, clarify these cards i'm going to start with some dialogue message cards here gemini <coughs> excuse me excuse my throat um let's start with some dialogue message cards gemini let's see if you guys could say something to each other what that would be and then of course i'll do the clarification for this gemini and their person spirit gemini and their person is it that somebody is choosing between two options and that's what the fight is all about I know my mind is still wandering all over the board right now because I do see a Queen of Wands and a Queen of Cups here. Okay, I've got three. All right, let's take a few more gems from another deck. And if any of you are looking for personal readings, Gemini, my email is in the description box below. You can reach me there. Gemini and the person. Thank you. And the last few from the third deck, Gemini. Let's spice it up a bit. Gemini and that person. Gemini and that person. Thank you. All right, Gems. The first uh, card I have here, one second, says, I regret my past mistakes and wish I could have another chance with you. I hunger for your touch, your kiss, and the warmth of your body. I want and I need you now. I realize I can't run from you because you're deep within me. We are one and eternally connected. When I run, I'm actually running from myself. When you've shown me in the mirror the reflection of what I don't like about myself and what I must heal. The distance between us is killing me. Maybe you guys are, well, not together at the moment. Whether together or apart, I feel a prisoner of your heart. You're all I want, my everything. I don't want to be free, for we are chained together in love. I wish I could have been emotionally available and let you in. I always felt your loving energy so strong as a comforting presence. It hurts me when I can't feel your energy. Are you pulling away from me? Whether we are together or when we are apart, my God, similar cards, right? You are always in my thoughts and forever in my heart. 
who knew that one of the greatest challenges of my life would be the love of my life, who after meeting would eternally haunt my very existence. All those secrets I kept caught up with me, each and every one of them. So gems, these were some of your messages. If these were resonating, let's start your reading with an angel blessing card. Let's see what my angels have for you today as a blessing, guidance, advice or a message for Gemini. Okay. And the card I have here for you gems is stress management. Well, it does see, I do see a lot of uh, frustration here, a lot of conflict, maybe self-conflict. Uh, in your own mind and that can lead to a lot of stress right gems so well it's time to take care of you maybe just do some yoga or deep breathing or talk to somebody who can help to clear out your thoughts and manage your stress so let's see why you're so st stressed out so spirit why is the uh, ten of pentacles in reverse today for gemini's reading ten of pentacles in reverse Okay, one more. I could be wrong here, Gemini. Does somebody want to uh, close out a past commitment and be single so they can pursue something else which they see as their long term? They want to take action towards this thing. The clarity is there, the drive is there, the wanting to shut down some old chapter and maybe move on to something they feel that they want for long term. Knight of Swords spirit, Knight of Swords. Yeah, they don't want to juggle anymore. They don't want to be in two worlds anymore. It's like I just want, I'm frustrated. How do, how do I drop one part of my existence, I guess, or maybe one commitment or something. Um, the Queen of Swords in reverse, Queen of Swords in reverse. Yeah, somebody is stuck maybe in a connection which could have been very um, well just sexual based but now they're feeling that uh, you know it's time to make that choice do I want to stay with you know this or should I make a choice to move on um, I think the first step you whoever this person is is taking is to stop communication with yeah that is a stoppage in communication and trying maybe blowing up a past connection which is making their past person very upset very angry very upset um why spirit two of wands in reverse two of wands in reverse yeah it's time to maybe i think somebody is making up their mind or choosing to get out of confusion Turning their back on something, maybe a past uh, situation which is not emotionally happy. Trying to choose a new path maybe, which could be leading to a lot of conflict with the old person maybe. I don't know, five of wands spirit. What's this, uh, what's this conflict about? Five of wands. Five of wands. Yes, somebody, is, uh, somebody doesn't want to be stressed maybe about a third party situation. Somebody just doesn't want to be stressed anymore about a third party situation. No longer wanting the stress and anxiety and sleepless nights. Maybe wanting to maybe follow their heart and go towards a soulmate. What's the four of pentacles in reverse spirit? Four of pentacles in reverse. Four of Pentacles in reverse. I don't know which one this is, but somebody here feels they feel the feeling the lack of love, feeling little ungrounded, feeling the lack of love and not knowing which direction or how to move now to heal whatever they've broken because they either feel they'll feel rejected or uh, 
you know, what if I get rejected? What if maybe, maybe they've been caught by the old person or new person or something. Somebody is very exhausted and tired trying to leave a situation and move towards a new one. Maybe there's a choice between two. I don't know. Queen of Wands spirit. Queen of Wands. And the Queen of Cups. Yeah, see, there is there is a, maybe a f younger fire sign that somebody is stalling or trying to stall things with. Maybe moving on towards a Queen of Cups who could be older, very loving, very, you know, moving on towards finding happiness with a new person. Uh, Page of Pentacles. Page of Pentacles. Page of Pentacles. They don't have much hope. Yeah, they don't have much hope as much as they want to start anew, as much as they want to start from scratch and say, hey, I'm ready now. I'm ready to have equal give and take. But certain things have been revealed about this person, this King of Wands person who wants to make that change. This whatever has been revealed about maybe their past or whatever, which has been actually they feel very unwise, foolish decisions on their uh, on their side. Uh, they don't have much hope. They feel because maybe in the past there was a third party situation or something, they are fearing that uh, their person, the person they really want to go towards may cut them out or they'll reject them or uh, maybe ask too many questions. I don't know. So as much as what a per one per that's the conflict. I want to go towards my new person, right? But if I leave the old person there is bitterness there's anger there's fighting and if i do manage to do that if i go to the new person will they accept me back right so six of uh, pentacle spirit why was that an overall energy for uh, gemini's reading today six of pentacles six of pentacles okay yep, same cards again same cards again. Yeah, somebody really does want. Maybe in the past they were breadcrumbing two people or giving to more than two. But now see, this person really wants to start again. A stable, brand new beginning. Let's start from scratch. I'm ready for this equal give and take now. I think uh, maybe they've fallen in love with a new person. I don't know. Uh, they don't want to spend the rest of their life you know, in sorrow, in regret. And as much as I think they don't want to shut this chapter down with a new person, they want to have a go around with a new person, they're a bit scared. They're a bit scared to maybe express themselves. There is fear here. There is... Uh, so I think the entire conflict, whatever is happening, is happening in this masculine's head at the moment, where they are very stressed out in between worlds, I would say. In between worlds. So well, that's all I have for you now and yeah, they, they want to drop this past baggage from what I'm seeing but very confused, very confused. How do I become single? How do I move on to uh, my new life? How do I remove the toxic situation which has happened in my past? There's a lot of sadness, regret, guilt, shame and that is what is leading to the stress. Okay. So, well, that's all I have for you, gems. Till next time then, love and light. Take care. Namaste.